Then. Today, one of these lucky couples could win a dream vacation. Meet Fred and Julie Baker. He's a buyer at an aerospace company who likes softball and swimming. She's a homemaker who loves to sew and do crafts. Meet Ted Johnson and Robin Bast. He's in sales and likes playing the clarinet. She's a waitress who enjoys playing with her children and exploring new places. They're all here to play the wildest shopping game ever, the new shop, Till You Drop. And here's the host of the new shop, Till You Drop, Pat Finn. Thank you very much. Hello, everybody. Welcome into our studio here on the new Shop You Drop. Hi to you at home. Thanks for tuning in once again. And uh, special hello to our contestants, of course. First of all, Robin and Ted, good to have you guys here. You've been Hi together you. for how long now? Ten months. Ten months. And how did you meet? At a dance. Yeah? I made him go on a date with me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fast dance or slow dance? Both. 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 Very good. All right, cool. Nice and romantic. All right, Julie and Fred, you two are married, right? Yes. And uh, any kids? Two. We have two kids. Yeah? A boy and a girl. Any pictures? No pictures. <laughs> well, you can say their so names at least. Talon and Samantha. Okay. Talon yeah. and Samantha. <laughs> Very cool. All right, you two on the toss. You get to go first. Come with me. Just right, stand right here. Listen carefully because in a moment we'll give you a chance to play if you decide you want to do that. Now, some people will travel around the world to find the finest names in fashions, and here's your chance. On our wall over here are the various names of famous fashion designers from different countries. And I'll tell you who they are. First of all, you see uh, Laura Ashley there. Then Jean-Paul Gaultier, then Issei Miyake, Prada, then down to Diane von Furstenberg, Donna Karen, and Wolfgang Jupp. Now, as I say go, Fred, what's going to happen is you're going to be spinning Julie around here at least one time, and then you'll scream out stop when you want her to land in front of a particular nation's flags. And if you want to know what nations we're going to, we'll say uh, to where, to Dean? Where, Dean? <laughs> Italy, Belgium, Japan, United States, <laughs> France, United Kingdom, and Germany. That takes a lot of talent to do that yeah, that quick. Wow. Very good. All right, well, what you're going to do is grab the flag and place it next to the, the designer that comes from that country. And if you can get five correct matches in 60 seconds, you'll win. Okay? Now, what do you think? Pass or play? What do you want to do? Uh, one, Let's pass. pass. We're going to pass. pass. Okay, head over there. Robin and Ted, this one's yours. Come on over here, if you will. And uh, Robin, we'll ask you to get in position uh -huh. there. We're going to put 60 seconds on the clock. And you'll need to move as quickly as possible. Ready, set, and go. Spin her around. Uh, she's been around one full time. Okay, you're on France. Grab the France flag and put it next That's to the country. Right. What's your side? Spin around, has to go around one full time. Okay, she's been around once. Okay, you can stop now. That's Germany's flag. Hustenberg! Where? Hustenberg! Downstairs, third flag. Okay, quickly, you're on the clock. You're on France again, so spin her again, spin again, spin again. At least one around. You gotta go around at least one time. There, you're on the United States. Ashley, Ashley, first one. Okay, quickly. Mm. Out of time, so how many do we have up there? We only have four up there, so at this point you guys can't win, but if you'll step over here, just let me uh, run through them for people that might be watching at home and wondering. Laura Ashley is actually from the United oh. Kingdom. Gautier is from France. Issey Miyake is from Japan. Prada, Italy. Diane van Furstenberg, Belgium. Donna Karen from the United States. And Wolfgang Jupp from Germany. Back to the center corner for them all, please. Okay, you'll get your chance again in a moment, I promise. Julian Fred, well, it's now your chance. So come on with me right over here. Right here. Now, when you pass, you automatically get the next stunt, and you guys got it here, and you're gonna get a chance to play. Actually, what's happening is we're throwing a dinner party that's gonna turn this mall upside down. Well, in fact, it's already upside down. As you can see, we've got the dinner table right there above you. And now we're going to help you uh, have you help us serve some food. 
On our counter are several different food items here. And as I say go, you'll both take a spatula and start flipping food up at the <laughs> table. Dee, can you show us how this would work? Yeah. Oh, you got your own food with I, you? I brought a banana to flip. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Very cool. Observe. Okay. okay. Here we go. Flip it up. Hit that. Very good. Stuck just like that. X, good job. Thank you. <laughs> that was fun. He does actually pay us to be on this show, <laughs> by the way. He loves it. All right. If you can get all the food items stuck to the table in 45 seconds, you guys will win. Okay? So we'll put you into position here. 45 seconds on the clock. It's uh, interesting food items for the party here. It's a cholesterol party. Okay, ready, set, and go. Okay, it'll stick if you hit there. You got one, there you go. If something falls off, we'll grab it for you. You can use your hand to put it on the spatula if you want. Put this out front. Look out, stuff is flying everywhere. Okay, keep going. You just gotta watch how it hits. It'll definitely, and all of these will stick. And sometimes we got some chicken back here. I'll get the chicken back here. All right, move quickly, you guys. Find an empty space. If you hit on something that's already there, it's not going to stick. There's a biscuit. Oh, find the empty space. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> so close, you guys. You only missed it by two. Sorry. Back here to center court. That's the hardest I've had to work on a stunt in a long time. All right, we're going to come back. We've got more stunts. They're going to work hard and have some fun, too, right after this. So don't go away. Visit them online. Welcome back. It is time now for round two of our stunts, worth 200 points apiece this time. And Robin and Ted, you can go first if you like. Come with me. Listen up because you can also pass at this point in the game if you decide you want to do that. Now, this area of the mall combines shopping and the familiar kids' game called Hangman. Now, over there, we have a blender, and you're going to be pricing that blender. Also, you can see our wall. On the wall, we have hidden letters. Now, the first thing you must do is call out the letters until you can reveal and unscramble the price word. And for every wrong letter called out, Hangman D will draw a body part onto the gallows. D, you going to come out here and give us a hand? Oh, yes, I will. He, he's, re <laughs> he's, he's ready. <laughs> if he draws six body parts, by the way, you guys will lose. So as soon as you can unscramble the price, shout it out in a minute, and you'll win. Okay? If okay. you play. What do you think? Pass or play? Play. Play. You play? Okay, good. I'll get in the position over here. We're going to put one minute on the clock. D, if you'll help me on that side there... Uh, Flip these down as we do it, and we'll Alrighty. see if I can get to it. Are you ready? Yes. Set, yes. and start calling out letters. Y. Y. There is a Y, y. right here. What's your next one? Uh, e. 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 Okay, e. 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 There are no E, so no three E's. D draw something. No. Go ahead. Next I. one. I. We do have we do have an I right here. Okay. T. Say T. again. T. 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 There is a T on number six here, D. N. Okay, there is no N, so draw something in. No ends. What's your next one? Uh, F. 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 F down at that end. Yes, we have an F. Go ahead. Next one, quickly. No E. B. Uh, B. B. V. No Vs. Draw another one. S. 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 Another another one for the S. And quickly. Oh 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 oh. Okay, we have two Ts here. There's the O. R. 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 Yes, there is an R in that end and this end. Very good. 54. No, you need the last letters here. B. With the last letters, you would have gotten to an H here and a U there. And that would have been for you, what do you think? 34. 34. You had the 4 right, but not the 54. Sorry, you guys. Back here to Santa Court. Thanks, D. Okay. In a moment, you'll get a chance to play some more, but Julie, and come on over here, and we'll see what happened to Fred. Yeah, right here. Well, you know, certain celebrities just seem to defy their age, and Pee Wee Herman is certainly one of them, right? Well, for this game, you must decide if Pee Wee is older or younger than the person or item I'm going to show you. And just so you know, Pee Wee Herman was born in 1952, which makes him 45 years old, okay? Mm -hmm. So, uh, Dee, would you like to bring Pee-wee out here? Here so comes Pee-wee. Oh. Oh. 
Knock a little sense into myself there, I think. There it is. Right there, Pee-wee. Uh, okay. <laughs> Not even on a bad day did Pee-wee ever look that bad, but okay. Uh, what we've done is uh, we've actually arranged to have Pee-wee here himself, and what we've done is dressed up your partner, of course, to look like Pee-wee, and every time you get one right as we do this, he can remove part of Pee-wee's costume. And if you can okay. get five out of seven right, you guys are going to win. Okay. Okay, so you need to get at least five right out of seven, and you can take off a part of the costume every time we do it. Okay. Understand? So if you stand right there on that corner right there, and we'll move through this uh, as quickly as possible. Okay, we have for you the first one. TV dinners, older or younger what? than Pee Wee? Older. Older. You say older. Actually, older. they're younger by two years. Pee Wee was born in 1952, by the way. We said it was 45 okay. years old. Next one, Benny Crocker cookbook. Older or younger than Pee Wee? The, the book is younger. Younger? Right, younger? No, older by two oh. years. Sorry. You need to get the rest of these right in okay. order to do it. Okay. The Frisbee, older or younger right. than Pee Wee? What do you want? You say younger. younger, right, by five years. Very good. Next one we have for you. Take something off over there. Uh, taking off the tie. And the next one we have is the bikini. Older or younger than younger. the peewee? Younger. You say younger? No, it's actually uh, older by six years. Bikini first came about in 1946. Uh, didn't do it, you guys. Oh, Not enough to win. You can just take off those glasses and head back here to center court. Just tell me you're going to be good at answering questions, all right? Yeah, just, just, well. <laughs> okay, good, very good. Because that's what's next. It's our Shop Me Drop Child Shoppers Challenge right after this. Go oh, away. Welcome back to our show. It is time now for our Shoppers Challenge round. And in just a moment, we're going to go very quickly because you're going to have a minute and a half in order to find out who's going to have a chance to go on to the final round. In the meantime, we'll talk slowly because, quite frankly, we have a lot of extra time because we didn't spend any time giving any prizes away yet. <laughs> you guys haven't won any stunts. Uh, but uh, I assure you, somebody is going to win this game in just a few moments. And once that happens, that person and that team will have a chance to go on to the final round and a chance at the dream vacation. Here's how it works. I ask you questions about things in a shopping mall. You press down on your lockout. I'll call out your name. If you're right, we give you 50 points. If you're wrong, we give your opponents three seconds to answer the question. Then you'll switch places with your partner. We do it for a minute and a half. Team with the most points at the end of the round goes on to shop till they drop. So good luck. <laughs> Ladies in the position, here's a minute 30 seconds on the clock. Is the Celica a model of Toyota, Honda, or Acura? Yes, Toyota. Well, pardon? Toyota. Correct. Hasbro, Whammo, or Dayglow? Which is not a toy company? Yes, Day Glow. Correct. Which city down under will play host to the Summer Olympics in 2000? Yes, Julie. Sydney. Correct. Toddlers sing, I'm a big kid now, for what diaper company? Pamper. Fre uh, nope. Do you know, Ted? Huggies. Huggies is correct. Where would you shop for wind chimes? Starbucks. The yes? Don't know, Robin? Starbucks, The Nature Company, or Nine West, Julie? The Nature Company. Correct. Is the product Jet Dry made for your clothes dryer, refrigerator, or dishwasher? Yes, Fred. Dishwasher. Correct. How many actors have played James Bond? Five, six, or seven? Julie? Five. Nope. Robin? Six. Nope, it's seven. Ball peen, claw, and mallet are types of what hand tool? Fred. Hammer. Correct. How fast does the Earth travel around the sun? 650, 6,500, or 65,000 miles per hour? Yes, Julie. 65,000. That's correct. Who's next in line for the presidency after the vice president? The Secretary of State, the Speaker of the House, or First Lady? Fred. Speaker of the House. Correct. Name the river that runs through the Grand Canyon. Colorado. That's correct. How old is Dick Clark? 58, 68, or 78? Yes, Six. Fred. 68. Correct. What are you shopping for if you inquire about whoopers and tweeters? Ah, yes, speakers. Well, correct. Sanka, Spam, or 7-Up? Which came first? Spam. <laughs> No, it is Sanka and Julie and Fred. You're going to shut this up. Thank you, guys. Thanks for being here. It's nice meeting you. Thank you. You can head off in that direction. You did. I told you. <laughs> Somebody was going to win this one. We'll come back. They'll run around, and we'll all shop till we drop right after this. Don't go away. You want
welcome back. You guys can stop applying. They're applauding for you now, everybody is. See, because mm -hmm. you, you've won. This is your chance for the big dream vacation. Now, who's going to be our uh, buyer and who's our exchanger? As we I'm do buying. This? I'm exchanging. So you're doing the running here as we do this, Fred. Yes. Have, you, have you trained for this yet? I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, so the way it's going to work is in a moment, I'm going to have you open up the first of our boxes here, Julie. Together, you guys will decide very quickly if you're going to keep that item or exchange it. If you're going to keep it, Fred, you'll run it over to our prize table there, give it to D, and then hit the bell. As soon as you hear that bell, Julie, that tells you you can open up the next lid. Now, if you're going to exchange something, just take it back to any store in our mall, leave it there, and bring back the box from that store. In the end, we're going to work our way down the table, and we'll be adding up the retail value of all the prizes. And if they add up to $2,500 or more, you two will win a dream vacation. To where? D. You're going to the Caribbean. Temptress, the unique Echo Adventure cruise through Belize and Guatemala. Explore rainforests and Mayan ruins. Swim and snorkel in the Caribbean Sea from Temptress Adventures. Shop till you drop travel arrangements provided by American West and Travel Savers, the nation's leading chain of independent travel agencies. Over 2,000 locations nationwide. Travel Savers, 800-726-SAVE. <laughs> You guys would like this one, I could tell? Yes. yes. Yes, okay, good. I'll give you a minute, 30 seconds on the clock. Here's your first box. Ready, set, and go. Good luck. Inside, it's a bronze coffee maker. We're going to take it back and head up to, uh, what's he going to stop? Mr. Gadget, I think he's yelling. Yeah, that's what he picked up on. Mr. Gadget's the place. Back down the steps, get over to D. And hit the bell. Very good. Next one. New home sewing machine. Exchange. First day. Stopping off at Beauty Secrets by Tanya. Give it a game. Yes. Okay, next one. Boy, little label system. Keep her shade. Going back. Three times upstairs. That's not easy. No training prepared here for that, Fred, I'm told. <laughs> yeah, every once in a while after the show's over, Dee and I just run around the mall for the heck of it just to see what it's like, just so we can have compassion for what you go through as contestants. And um, Anyway, we're going to see if we can get you guys to the Caribbean, if yeah. we can get to $2,500 worth of stuff in these boxes here. And, of course, you get to keep whatever's in the boxes, like this from Beauty Secrets by Tanya. Dee, tell us about it. Try Pampers You in Style, an exciting gift selection of his and her personal care products, hair and skin treatments for health and beauty from Try Institute of Technology. Retail value, and this is $300. Yeah, so that's nice. Good. Next, we go to Mr. Gadget. It's actually the first place you ran to upstairs, and you came back down with this, Steve. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir, Pat, the Auric Lightweight Vacuum. It's <laughs> hypoallergenic, 100% made in America, and weighs only 8 pounds from the Auric Corporation. With two kids at home, you can always use one yeah, of those, right? <laughs> Retail value of this is $400. Oh, Good for you, 1800 to go. J&B Sports of All Sorts is our place, and, well, hopefully it's more than just this basketball, right, Dave? What is it? It's much more Harvard Serious Play mobile basketball system. Now basketball can be portable, even for the serious player. The Serious Play mobile system from Harvard. These are really cool, and they're worth $499. That's very cool. Hey, you got a great start going. 1301 to go, and we still have three boxes to open up here. Oh, Trying to get you guys to the Caribbean as we go to Chuck's department store next. And inside Chuck's, we come back out with this, D. An O'Sullivan computer station, the cockpit. Comfortably correct computer workstation. The bold cherry finish. Brass accents for that complete look from O'Sullivan, an office product leader. <laughs> what does that mean? I said, do you have a computer? And she well, said, we well, yes, sort of. We do now. <laughs> oh, we do now. Well, you've got a computer station, you've got a computer. What the? $500, you guys. And that's good because it's just 8.01 to go as we go to gifts galore next. And inside we have uh, this, D. 
Pat, it's Global Link translation software allows you to communicate with friends all over the world. With a touch of your finger, your English message translates to French, Italian, Spanish, or German. Makes foreign countries seem just like next door. Global Link. Retail value in this one is $550. Oh, All right, getting close. All right, getting very close. 251, 251 to go to get you guys to the Caribbean. Either way, you get to keep all this great stuff that you want on the show here. So, so far, so good. We'll we look inside it. Heidi's housewares and we come back out with the rug, rug doctor. doctor. Okay. The new rug doctor carpet cleaner removes deep down dirt. <laughs> Cleaning your carpet is easier than before. Rent or own the new lighter rug doctor steam carpet cleaner. You know, it's actually perfect, too, for getting, like, sand and suntan lotion out of the carpet when you come back yeah! from the Caribbean. You did it. Congratulations. You won the trip. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, guys. Hey, and thank you for being here. This is Pat Finn for Key Baker and the entire Stone Stanley family saying thanks for watching, and I hope we'll see you next time right here on the new... <laughs> Fast dance or slow dance? Oh, both, both. 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 Very good. All right, cool. Nice and romantic. All right, Julie and Fred, you two are married, right? Yes. And uh, any kids? Two. We have two kids. Yeah? A boy and a girl. Any pictures? No pictures. <laughs> well, you can say their so names at least. Talon and Samantha. Okay. Hi, Talon and yeah. Samantha. <laughs> Very cool. All right, you two want to toss. You get to go first. Come with me. Right, Just stand right here. Listen carefully because... Then. Today, one of these lucky couples could win a dream vacation. Meet Fred and Julie Baker. He's a buyer at an aerospace company who likes softball and swimming. She's a homemaker who loves to sew and do crafts. Meet Ted Johnson and Robin Bast. He's in sales and likes playing the clarinet. She's a waitress who enjoys playing with her children and exploring new places. They're all here to play the wildest shopping game ever, the new shop, Till You Drop. And here's the host of the new shop, Till You Drop, Pat Finn. Thank you very much. Hello, everybody. Welcome into our studio here on the new shop, You Drop. Hi to you at home. Thanks for tuning in once again. And a uh, special hello to our contestants, of course. First of all, Robin and Ted, good to have you guys here. You've been Thank together you. for how long now? Ten months. Ten oh, ten and months. how did you meet? At a dance. Yeah? I made him go on a date with me. <laughs> <laughs> in a moment, we'll give you a chance to play if you decide you want to do that. Now, some people will travel around the world to find the finest names in fashions, and here's your chance. On our wall over here are the various names of famous fashion designers from different countries. And I'll tell you who they are. First of all, you see uh, Laura Ashley there then Jean-Paul Gaultier, then Issei Miyake, Prada, then down to Diane von Furstenberg, Donna Karen, and Wolfgang Jupp. Now, as I say go, Fred, what's going to happen is you're going to be spinning Julie around here at least one time, and then you'll scream out stop when you want her to land in front of a particular nation's flags. And if you want to know what nations we're going to, we'll say uh, to where, to Dean? Where, Dean? Italy. 